Hello YouTube. Uh, today I was trying to install this drape rod um, and what you see in front of me is is what I got in the box. So and um, it took me some 30 minutes to understand how to put this uh, because I wanted to use the extension rod. Uh, unfortunately, I was not able to understand how the extension rod works uh, because if you see the what I thought which came out of the package is the middle one. The middle rod was the extension rod which was not the case because the the middle rod has a a block, a, a screw on a place where you can put a screw and uh, the other end of this middle rod is an empty hole. And now I was trying to figure out how I'm going to make this middle rod uh, work with these two other ends because I have the crowns in the end of the other two. It seems like uh, when they package this, um, this is how it comes, but you are supposed to take out the crown and uh, and the, 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 the middle one, which doesn't come with any, any kind of fixtures, is not the extinction uh, rod. The thinnest one out of all the three is the extinction tension rod and uh, that already comes mounted with this crown so what you have to do is like first this is how it comes out of the package so first you remove this extension uh, the crown <coughs> Not okay so now you remove this I think some other brands. Uh, this is this is a brand I bought in Home Depot. Some other brands come with a come with another uh, way to put the crown. But if you see this extension where the crown was installed, remove this out of this thinner rod. Now we are removing. We removed the crown and and the screw, uh, the double double edged screw from the thinnest rod we found in the package. So the thinnest rod that you found in the package. Um, so we have to remove this. I don't think the instructions uh, say about this. And now you install this screw. And I, when I showed you the middle one, it had one end of it was, was able to take a screw. So now we're going to install in that. I'm just going to pause the video and set the camera aside so that I can do it with, with my both my hands. Okay, I'm still holding the camera, but but we took this one out from the thinnest rod and now we are installing it in the middle one. Okay, you install the crown that we removed from the thinner rod to this one. Okay, so now of all the three, uh, we got the two bigger rods, like the, uh, the bigger rods having the crowns and now we have this center rod as an extinction. So now what we're going to do is, uh, so if you see, once, once we reassembled it, you have an opening, which is an opening which can take this thinner rod inside on one end of the, the other end of the crown. And in the other rod also, there is an opening that can take a thinner rod. And now you have two rods the fatter rods are having the crowns in the end and the thinner rod is ready to go on either way. So I'm just going to show you that. So the thinner rod, you can see one, the thinner rod goes on this side and the other side. Now, now you have a a rod end to end with the crowns which you can adjust now according to this uh, 
to the size that you want according to your window size. So I'm going to place my rod in that and adjust it accordingly, whichever I want. So this is how you do it. This is a Home Depot. Uh, I think the brand is called Home uh, Home Drape Rods. So if you uh, if you now you know that how you can uh, use the extension rod. The extension rod does not come separate, so you have to remove and put it together. If this video helped, please like. Um, thank you for watching. You have a good day.